Hello, it's Professor Fiore. In this sequence of videos, we're going to be looking at operational amplifiers. This sequence of videos is designed to dovetail with the free OER text, operational amplifiers and linear integrated circuits. And you can find this on my webpage, my Mohawk Valley Community College webpage. Just come down here to the link for the free books. And here we have all of the free OER texts that I've written along with lab manuals. So we're looking at operational amplifiers and linear integrated circuits, third edition. This is a roughly 600 page text available in PDF, open document text and print formats. If you click on print, this will take you to Amazon for a relatively inexpensive print soft cover version of the text. But as I said, it is free for the download. There is a matching lab manual right here. Again, PDF ODT print format. Here's a quick look at the PDF. You can see the labs in here. So we have quite a few labs, beginning with uh, the basics working our way through with different kinds of negative feedback and so forth, practical issues, um, and finally winding up with some pretty nice looking filters over here. Now the lab manual and the text are both in eight and a half by 11 format. So this allows for easy printing. If you want to pin out a, a few pages um, or a you know, section of the, of the text, so let's take a look at what's in here. So here's your introductory elements. This is essentially on decibels and Bode plots. Then we look at the internals of an op amp. We look at negative feedback, different kinds of negative feedback, the effects, basic op amp circuits, inverting and non-inverting amplifiers, summing amplifiers, things of this nature. And then we look at some practical characteristics, things like gain bandwidth products, slew rate, power bandwidth, um, offsets, drift, common mode rejection, lots of other good stuff. We have a chapter on specialized op amps, devices that are very fast, very high power, things of this nature. Then we have a section on nonlinear circuits, precision rectifiers, function generation, voltage regulation comes in chapter eight. So we're looking at both linear and switching regulators. Of course, there will be uh, special purpose integrated circuits discussed in there. Oscillators and frequency generators. Integrators and differentiators. Yes, you can actually get op amps to perform calculus for you. Active filters. And we finish off with analog to digital and digital to analog conversion systems. Bunch of appendices back here. We'll just run in here real quick like. So a typical chapter here, we have um, a lot of examples, good graphics, color, right? There's color in here. Um, the print textbooks are all black and white just to save cost, right? Because you always have access to these uh, free PDFs and ODTs. And uh, as we work down through, you'll also see there are some um, data sheets, manufacturer's data sheets. There are, um, you know, worked worked out examples, certainly, um, theoretical considerations and so forth. And uh, at the end of the chapter, we have problems, quite a few, right? We have grouped in different sections, uh, challenge problems, computer simulation problems, right? So there are simulations throughout the text. And uh, at the end, in the appendices, you will see the selected answers to these problems, roughly every other problem uh, we have in the back. Okay. All right. So that's what we're looking at there. Of course, you can use any accompanying book to go with these videos, but um, they are designed to sort of dovetail nicely with this particular text. Right? So whatever works for you. If you're in need of a simulator, I recommend Tina TI. This is a free simulator that you can get on the Texas Instruments site. Just download here. And this runs on Windows. 
if you uh, are running a different operating system, the uh, Tina people, ZineSoft, they have a cloud version, a web version, which for students is very inexpensive. It's currently $12 a year. So that's another good option to consider. Okay, so we will uh, begin our next video looking at the, uh, the basics, right? That chapter one, which covers differential amplifiers. That's sort of the heart of the op amp and decibels and Bode plots. And we'll go from there. See you then.